Every year, thousands of monarch butterflies dance through the air over North Florida, migrating between their winter grounds in Mexico and their regular homes along the U.S. Atlantic coastline. Thousands of people flock to Florida to witness this colorful pageant featuring the most famous insect in the country. But every year, there have been fewer and fewer of the well-known butterflies. A new University of Florida study, the longest of its kind, has found that the number of caterpillars and butterflies in North Florida has been declining for three decades. Since 2005, the numbers have dropped by 80 percent. It's alarming, said Associate Professor Jarrett Daniels, a co-author of the study. Since 2005, the rate of decline has been steady. For the study, a team of scientists closely monitored how many monarchs showed up each spring in a single herbicide-free cattle pasture in Cross Creek, one time home of acclaimed Florida author Marjorie Canaan Rawlings. At the site, 20 miles south of Gainesville, the team gathered to examine the pasture's milkweed plants for any caterpillars. They also captured adult monarch butterflies to check the growth or decline of the population. They spent 37 years doing this, the equivalent of 140 generations of monarchs. Daniel said that if a well-known and widely beloved insect like the monarch can be pushed toward extinction so easily, it shows just how imperiled other, less well-known species might be. For the Tampa Bay Times, I'm Craig Pittman.